Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Mangy. Welcome to the Moto Mangy channel. For this new Moto vlog in my Centralia series, I'm going to take Big Mine Run Road heading east off Main Street Centralia down to one of the cooler sites to see in the area. Lesser known sites too. Something we like to call the Pennsylvania Geyser or the Pennsylvania Old Faithful. It's a, uh, well, what it really is is a pressure relief valve for the mine shafts. Because even around Centralia, the shafts that are burning and on fire yet even today, there are lots of other shafts in the area that were abandoned in the same shut down that are presently filled with water and they're all flooded here's one of the old cemeteries in Centralia so here in 61 to 42 if you make a right turn you can head down to another nearby lesser known attraction in this area known as the Pennsylvania Geyser. If you come down this road, I think it's called Big Mine Road, if I remember right. You can find, it's not far, the biggest of the release valves, the one that releases the most pressure, Some days it's just a small geyser. But if you come on a day after like a lot of rainfall, like if we have like a lot of heavy rain, a day or two after that, after the rain stop, or during if it's still raining, but this geyser will bloom into something huge. I've been here before when the freaking thing is bursting like 20, 30, 40 feet in the air. It's pretty impressive, really. Yeah, it is Big Mine Run Road. That's what this is called. It's essentially, head east out of Main Street, Centralia. And this road's pretty nice to ride, too. Very scenic. You'll come down into Ashland on the outskirts of it. And here you're at the stop sign. You want to make a right turn. It's not far from here. Turn right here. right up by these houses, past the river, the little brook. Oh, you can see it here off to the left. <laughs> there she is, there she blows. A Pennsylvania geyser. She's doing pretty good today. Don't sink in the mud, please. You see there's another runoff here from the pressure, from the water pressure coming up out of the mines. This one, some of them are capped off. But this is a pipe just like this one right here, but it's not capped off. And this is water pressure from the mine shaft being released out of the ground. The shaft is down several hundred feet beneath us. And look at all the red runoff. I'm not sure what the concrete embankments are for. Probably just to reinforce the ground, I guess. So the water doesn't erode it away. 
Because it probably would if it could. Now this is a mild day for Old Faithful here. Like I said, I've seen it up, halfway up the tree. I mean, I've seen it just blasting out of the ground. <laughs> and it gets loud too when it has that kind of pressure. But it's pretty sweet. I mean, it's quite the sight to see. You can see all the red tint and the dirt coming out of the water with it. That's from down beneath the earth, down the mine shaft. Don't know why it's that reddish tint, but it is. So yeah, this is the Pennsylvania geyser. In Centralia, Pennsylvania. Stop, don't fall. Very cool. All right, so if you're ever in the area, oh, I almost fell there, geez. So if you're ever in the area of Ashland, Pennsylvania, pay a visit to Centralia. It's a nice little ghost town. Kind of spooky to visit, but worth visiting. And then right around the area because there's some pretty scenery and some nice roads around here too. Come see the old geyser here. All right, well, thanks for watching everyone. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, hit the like button. If you want to see more, subscribe to my channel. Take care of yourselves, ride safe, and see you next time.